a Midlands attorney. Early today, Stanley Myers, a prominent member of South Carolina's legal community, died at the young age of 47. We're joined now by News 19's Nate Stanley, who spoke with members of the community about this loss. Nate. JR, a dedicated family man is how everyone I spoke to described Stanley Myers. They say a loss like his will be felt throughout the state of South Carolina. It's been a nightmare day for Russell Ott after hearing about the passing of Stanley Myers. He's been a longtime friend of Myers. They met while attending the Citadel in Charleston. We went to, to football camp together and our coach put us together as roommates. Anyone that he ever came into contact with got a, a glimpse of that great smile and that great laugh. And he just would carry on a conversation with anyone and everyone and, and treat them like family. The Lexington County Coroner says Myers passed away Wednesday from natural causes. Myers leaves behind a wife and two kids. Ott says those were the focus of his life and goals. I just can't go back and tell you enough about, you know, the father that he was and the husband that he was. He was Superman to his two kids. Myers was a lieutenant colonel in the South Carolina Army National Guard, where he served as a military judge, being the first ever African American to do so in South Carolina. It's the kind of legacy that has inspired young men like Tyler Swain Mitchell. That, that was the inspiration for us because it's important that we see someone that you know, that looks like us that's been through, you know, the, 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 the experience like it's an experience like no other. While at the Citadel, Myers became friends with 10 Miles. Now as the mayor of West Columbia, Miles tries to carry on the legacy of Myers while being a public servant. And Stanley was the type guy that if I had somebody who needed legal work in an area that I didn't practice, that I could send them to Stanley and I could know that they would be taken care of as well or better than I could take care of them myself. Cabral Garvin was mentored by Myers as a young student and now as a member of South Carolina's House of Representatives, still received advice from Myers. He called me last night while I was at a meeting and he texted me right after that phone call and said, hey, um, I know that we've been playing phone tag, but let's try to talk in the morning. And so, as we say in the Baptist church, I'm going to see Stanley in the morning, but not literally in the morning that we, that we thought that it, it would be, but it will be in that morning when, when both of us see our, our Heavenly Father. And Ott tells me the best way you can learn from Myers is the golden rule, treat others the way you want to be treated. Funeral arrangements for Myers have not been released yet, but we will provide those when we get them. In studio, Nate Stanley, News 19, WLTX. Thank <laughs> you.